WFNN. Headline News Update. What's going on, everyone? This is Jacob Shoup filling in for Tom O'Brien. This is the 4 p.m. stock market update. I hope you all had a good week, that it was somewhat profitable for you all. Let's take a look at what we're ending up on the day. It's a nice little movement to the upside, basically, right? You get a composite of about 1.22% right now. Drink at 18,137.84 cents. In the Dow Jones Industrial, up about 0.81%. Trading at 42,352, you have that dollar still pretty strong, okay? Trading at 102.48 on that counter trend bounce. Now keep in mind, you have that increasing dollar movement along with an increasing movement in equities, which usually sees some depression in the equities. Uh, you are seeing that kind of in line uh, with the gold contract off about 0.29%. Trading at 2,671, that E-mini is up about 0.85%. And then the Russell, inexplicably, is uh, responding to some lower interest rate cuts of about 1.42%. That was up even higher uh, earlier uh, today. And then silver's off uh, basically sideways, off about 0.04%, trading at 32.45 on that contract. And then copper itself still staying strong around that 450 area, trading at 457. Let's see what Steel Dynamics did today, because I didn't look at it last show. Okay, so we're bouncing up against that 130. So that's going to be the resistance. We'll see if we move back down to that 120, again, really keeping my eye on steel dynamics. Uh, some interesting news. This is uh, from the government. The Biden administration can move forward with student loan forgiveness. This is the federal judge ruled this. It's going to free up a lot of capital if this goes through. So the federal judge will let expire a temporary restraining order against the Biden administration's sweeping new student loan forgiveness plan, which could deliver relief to tens of millions of Americans. The plan could benefit as many as three in every four federal student loan holder when combined with administration's previous efforts. Yeah, really means that uh, Joe Biden may move forward with his administration's student loan forgiveness plan just weeks before the November election. Of course, that would be huge for them. Uh, spokesperson for the U.S. Department of Education said it appreciated the judge's ruling uh, that Georgia had no legal basis to bring the case, but slammed the GOP movement to stop the relief. Uh, that's obviously a pretty big play uh, for a voter base, without a doubt. Um, and things are just so expensive as they are now. Uh, especially living in the area I live in. Uh, something like that would be uh, immense. Folks, thank you so much for joining me this week. I was glad to fill in for Tom. Always love talking with you all. Uh, we're going to be back on Monday at 9 a.m. with Tommy O'Brien, the Morning Market Kickoff, followed by Basil, Steve Rhodes, Larry Pesavento, and then I believe we're going to have Tom back as well. Looking forward to it. Have a great weekend, everyone.